All right, so we just got some new leaks regarding Sonic X Shadow Generations. Obviously, the trailer's coming out tomorrow at the Summer Game Fest. But anyway, there have been new leaks that have surfaced thanks to some guy called Mystery Lupin on Twitter. Uh, he has some screenshots, and let's go one by one. So first, uh, he has the cover art, which in my opinion looks pretty sick. It's just this, I mean, it's just the Sonic Generations box art with both Sonics move further apart and put Shadow in the middle. Uh, they changed the background though, which looks pretty cool. They changed the platforms they're standing on. I think that's like Westopolis in the background or like the Black Arms. I don't know what that is. But they changed the background, which is pretty cool as well. And the pre-order bonus uh, is apparently going to be a booklet, which is made by Gerald Robot Robotnik, talking about how Shadow was created. And uh, there's also going to be a Sonic Adventure Legacy skin. In my opinion, Sonic Adventure Sonic probably should have been the original, but it's cool they're adding it now. And I think they're, they're just testing the waters to see how an Adventure Sonic would be received now. Because I think they want to do an Adventure remake, but they're kind of scared. In my opinion, they should just do it. Maybe remaster something less less favored by the fandom, something like Heroes, which uh, there's also been leaks of, but I'd go with Heroes first. If that works out, then do an adventure, because they don't. I don't think they want to ruin the adventure, the adventure series as a whole, because they're very beloved. And next, uh, we have two new screenshots as well. One of them is Shadow with what appears to be wings. I don't, I don't actually know if this is from anything in the past, but it just looks fire. Like, it actually looks sick. There's like an, a red electricity on Shadow. He's got like skeleton type wings, I think. I don't know what that is. That's the half moon, I'm pretty sure, that Eggman blew up. In my opinion, this looks pretty cool as a as a power-up or a, a, a level-up. I don't know what it's going to be. But I, from what I know, it, this isn't from any past Sonic game. This is something new, which I'm not against at all, bro. Two new screenshots, two other ones. It's just Shadow grinding on rails. One of them looks to be like Radical Highway, and the other looks like Westopolis, which I could, we, we probably could have assumed that they're going to be in the game. All right, this is me from the future. Uh, that is not where stop is, bro. That is Bullet Station. That that is 100% Bullet Station, bro. And it never crossed my mind, bro. But that level is actually is low key deep in the Shadow lore, bro. That's when Shadow finds out there are other versions of him. They're the androids, bro. That's when he started thinking he was a fake, bro. So it's not far off from the realm of possibilities that Bullet Station will be in the game. And uh, one more thing, I heard that the price is going to be 50 American dollars, which isn't full price, which is surprising. I thought they were going to go for 60, keep it like below the, the 70 for like new AAA games and keep it like for the, the normal remaster price. But it apparently it's coming out a bit cheaper than that, which is cool. I thought they were going to go higher, but I'm going to take it. I'm not going to complain, bro. And one more thing, this, this is the final thing. Apparently the release date is October 25th, 2024. Quite a bit away, but it's not too far. It's about four and a half months. To be fair, that's probably how long we're waiting for Superstars when it first revealed, but this looks to be better than Sonic Superstars in my opinion. I, I'll, I enjoy Sonic Superstars, just the boss fights ruined the whole thing, but this looks pretty fun. Very fun, actually. We're just going to have to see how well it turns out. I think it's going to be pretty good. Will it be as good as the original generations? Probably not, but I'm expecting like a 7.5, 8 out of 10 type of game. Either way, I'm excited. I hope you guys are too. Have a nice day and enjoy yourselves.